The fight continues within this stanza. Please continue to track names for Grendel's mom, the definition of a remarkable man, verbs, and who they belong to, as well as Christian ideology. There will be a great number of verbs as this is an action-packed stanza. Heaved and swung. In line 1520 are verbs that belong to Beowulf. Summary-wise, keep an eye out for who is winning the fight in this stanza, what Beowulf focuses on to prevent himself from losing heart, as well as who protects Beowulf. Now, please listen to this section and track the patterns I have assigned. Feel free to pause and rewind as needed. Hero observed that swamp thing from hell, the Tarnhag, in all her terrible strength, then heaved his war sword and swung his arm. The decorated blade came down ringing and singing on her head. But he soon found his battle torch extinguished. The shining blade refused to bite. It spared her and failed the man in his need. It had gone through many hand-to-hand -hand fights, had hewed the armor and helmets of the doomed. But here at last, the fabulous powers of that heirloom failed. Helak's kinsman kept thinking about his name and fame. He never lost heart. Then, in a fury, he flung his sword away. The keen inlaid worm loop patterned steel was hurled to the ground. He would have to rely on the might of his arm. So must a man do who intends to gain enduring glory in a combat. Life doesn't cost him a thought. Then the prince of the war gates, warming to this fight with Grendel's mother, gripped her shoulder and laid about him in a battle frenzy. He pitched his killer opponent to the floor, but she rose quickly and retaliated, grappled him tightly in her grim embrace. The sure-footed fighter felt suddenly daunted. The strongest of warriors stumbled and fell. So she pounced upon him and pulled out a broad, whetted knife. Now she would avenge her only child. But the mesh of the chain mail on Beowulf's shoulder shielded his life, turned the edge and tip of the blade. The son of Edgethow would surely have perished, and the Geats lost their warrior under the wide earth, had the strong links and locks of his war gear not helped to save him. Holy God decided the victory. It was easy for the Lord, the ruler of heaven, to redress the balance once Beowulf got back on his feet. 